Dear children of grade 6, now we are going to start lesson number 7. It is about magnets. Look at this picture. Here you can see a file clip in a glass of water. Can you suggest a way to get it out without either spilling the water or putting your hand in? Yes, you can. You can get it with the use of a magnet. This is a magnet because magnets have the special property of attracting things towards its direction. What is a magnet? A magnet is a material or object that produces a magnetic field. Now you know what is a magnet. Effects of magnets. You can do a simple activity to observe the effect created by magnets on other materials. Here you will need a magnet, some iron nails, some brass nails, a piece of copper wire, a piece of aluminium sheet, a coin, a piece of plastic, a piece of wood, a piece of paper and a needle. Keep each material near the magnet and observe the changes. Iron nail, a coin, a needle got attracted towards the magnet. Here you can see first diagram shows some coins got attracted towards the magnet. Second diagram shows some nails got attracted to two magnet. Third picture shows some iron fillings got attracted. But brass nails, a piece of a copper wire, a piece of aluminium sheet, a piece of plastic, a piece of wood, a piece of paper did not get attracted towards the magnet. Through this activity, we can understand some materials get attracted towards the magnets while some others do not. Now we are going to identify different types of magnets. The magnets differ from each other due to their shapes. You can see there are some shapes. Also, they are used for different purposes. First one is horseshoe magnet. Second one is a bar magnet. Third one is a U magnet, the shape of letter U. Fourth one is a ring magnet. Last one is a tabular magnet. What are magnetic poles? By doing the activity 7.2, you can understand whether the materials get attracted equal to each and every spot of a magnet. Here, you need some file clips or iron filling, a bar magnet, a piece of cardboard. First, spread the file clip or iron filling evenly on the piece of cardboard. Then, slowly lower the magnet towards the piece of cardboard. You will observe there are more file clips or iron fillings near the two ends of the magnet. The attractive power of the magnet is more at the ends than the middle. The two ends where the power of attraction is more are called magnetic poles. These are magnetic poles. 
the behavior of a magnet. By doing these two experiments, activity 7.3 and activity 7.4, you can understand that the magnet always stays here in between north and south. We can identify that the north pole of a magnet is the north pole of the compass and the south pole of the magnet is the south pole of the compass. We mark the south pole of a magnet as S, north pole of a magnet as N. Here south pole, here north pole. Interactions between the poles of magnet. By doing the activity 7.5, you can understand the same poles do not get attracted but get prepared. And the different poles get attracted. Here you can see south pole and south pole got prepared. Here South Pole and North Pole got attracted. What are magnetic forces? To do activity 7.7, .7, you will need a bar magnet, iron fillings, and a white paper. Keep the magnet under the paper and spread the iron fillings on the sheet of paper. Then tap the paper slowly. You can see that the iron fillings are arranged according to a pattern. Here, this is the pattern. The iron fillings fallen a little bit away from the magnet are seen an irregular, irregular manner. So we can say magnetic forces are spread around a limited area of a magnet. The area which the magnetism spread around the magnet is called the magnetic field. Demonstrating the magnetism. When we do this activity, you can observe the number of nails hung on magnets differ according to the power of the magnet. Here you can see there are three nails hung on the magnet. We can conclude that the magnet which bears the most number of nails has the highest magnetic power. This toy contains a magnet here and with the help of this magnet, it can lift small blocks. So try to engage in enjoyable activity using magnets. Thank you.